Well, for a lot of adventurers, a whitewater rafting trip through the Grand Canyon is, is probably on the bucket list. <laughs> yeah. I, I know it's on my bucket yeah, list. Yeah, I want to do it. But most canyon trips require several days and reservations, sometimes a year in advance. Not all trips, though. But on the west side of the Grand Canyon, the Oualapai Indian Tribe offers a one-day Grand Canyon rafting trip that packs in a lot of adventure, all the adventure, into a fraction of the time. And our Troy Hayden went along for a ride. Our day starts at 8 a.m. with a bus trip from Peach Springs, Arizona, about three and a half hours from the valley. Views from the bus are amazing. We're taking the only road that goes down into the Grand Canyon, and soon we see the Colorado River and our lineup of boats. The native Wallapai guides line up to say hello. And are we excited to climb on these boats? Yes. Welcome to the lower part of the Grand Canyon. My name is Cass Lee. I'll be your tour guide today. We'll be going about 36 miles of the Grand Canyon in Colorado River. And it's 36 miles of fun. It's not long before we hit our first rapids. The guide takes us right into the heart of it. The water is a bracing 45 degrees. The temperature in the canyon, well over 100. So getting splashed with the cold water feels good. And that's good because it happens a lot. How would I like you to hit it? <laughs> in the most exciting way possible. Between rapids, you're surrounded by canyon walls that rise some 3,000 feet into the sky. And you have time to think about the billion years it took the river to cut this huge canyon into the earth. You know, rafting's only part of the adventure on this trip. We also get to hike up to some springs on the side of the canyon. Let's go, let's go check them out. We hike to a natural spring using ropes and rope ladders. Look at this, it's amazing. Come on, come back here. Look at that waterfall. Fed from a spring up on top of the canyon. The water's warm and it's fun to let it rain down on you. A cool adventure in itself. The Wallapai guides talk a lot about the history of the canyon, the geology that's laid out there before us, and the serenity and spirituality here. A few more rapids, then we come to the end of the line. Our one-day Wallapai River Runner trip is over. What a way to raft the Grand Canyon in a single day. Troy Hayden, Fox 10 News. That is a ride. Well, the helicopter drops you off right next to the Grand Canyon Skywalk, so that can be part of the adventure as well. We've put information about the Wallapai River Runners on our website, fox10phoenix.com.